new camera unlocked. I've been talking about upgrading my equipment for so many months now because the camera that I'm filming with, which is my trusty G7X Mark II, has been through so much with me, including many, many falls, being dropped in a pool of rain. I think I spent maybe the last half year thinking about getting a new camera and then finally deciding on this one. She's so beautiful. Let's try it out. Even on the viewfinder, it looks so different. Ah, what do we think? Can you tell a difference between this camera and the one I was using? I keep looking to the side because the viewfinder is there and my old viewfinder was on top so it looked a little more natural, but this is really clear. You can see every pore and wrinkle and flake on my skin. <laughs> I don't usually get myself really expensive things. So I'm hoping this is a worth investment because putting down money for something nice is still hard for me. But so far I'm liking it. It looks really good and it feels more professional. The lens is huge so I'm literally talking to this like monstrosity of a unit lens. Yeah. Anyways, that is the unboxing. I keep looking to the side because I'm so not used to this but yeah. Oh, my eyes are so red. You guys, it's one o'clock right now, but my friend Catherine is hosting a cookie exchange tomorrow and it sounds really, really fun, but I don't really know how to bake cookies and that's kind of embarrassing for me to admit. This was one of the first sugar cookie recipes I saw, so if you guys have better recipes, please let me know. I would love to know how to make good cookies, but yeah, let's get started. Okay, so the recipe says to beat until fluffy, but I feel like my butter is just in chunks, so it's not really beatable. Butter is softened. Hopefully this isn't too warm. I can't believe this is the first step of the recipe and I'm already like messing it up. This feels much better. That looks really crispy. Ooh. A lot of craters in the bottom. Yeah, there are. There are. Yeah, there are. <laughs> it's really late. Right. It's not bad, but it's not very sweet. Mm. How Asians say like a dessert is good. Like, oh, not too sweet. I am baffled though by the amount of butter that I put into this. I like it a lot, actually. Mm -hmm. I well. want to eat more now. Happy Sunday. So I think our sugar cookies were a success yesterday. So I'm actually, I have it right here. And I'm going to Catherine's Cookie Exchange. Hopefully people like the sugar cookies. Fingers crossed, I would be devastated if people don't like it, but I'm waiting for the subway and I think I'm slightly late because I missed the last subway, but it's okay. This recipe called for like sea salt flakes, and I was like, should I? Where do you get these from? Whole Foods. Oh. Yeah. Wow. What did you make? Raspberry miso chocolate chip. And it was actually really simple because I've never made cookies before. That's like a milestone. Congrats. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah. This is a giant, giant box. So I got some stuff from Waterdrop and they are kindly sponsoring this portion of the video. So thank you to Waterdrop. I worked with them last year, but I just love, love, love their mission of making drinking water more sustainable, reducing plastic consumption and encouraging people to just drink more water. So I did get a couple of flavors of micro drinks from them and they have so many options on the website. I remember one of my favorites from last year was 
the peach micro drink. Another reason I really like these little cubes that you throw into your water is because these are sugar free, vegan, gluten free, and they just taste really, really good. So I wanted to pop one of these in a glass of water and it's super easy, you just push it. You have these little cubes. You take one, you get a glass of water and you just plop it in. As you can see, the little cube is still fizzing, but yeah, that was like the easiest thing ever. If you guys want to check them out, I'm going to link their website down below. And I have a 15% off coupon right here. And yeah, thank you to Waterdrop for sponsoring this portion of the video. Yeah. Yeah, you caught him in a moment. Hey. Jesus, that should taste bad. Oh. Oh. No, you're not. You're good. I'm videoing. What do you want to tell the viewers? I'm in this pose because I fell, not because I'm posing. Yeah, she's not doing a pose. Good morning. I didn't really get to vlog yesterday because I was just busy falling and crying. <laughs> but it's our second and last day and I think I have the hang of it. So I'm gonna try to film a little bit more because it's actually so pretty on the mountains. Like when you're not busy looking at your feet, it's so beautiful to look out. So I'm gonna try to capture that a little bit and, mm, and try not to fall so much today. I have on so many layers. I have like four layers on. It's cold, but it is not actually as cold as I thought it would be. So yeah, I think we're heading out soon and we're just getting ready to go. Hey guys, <laughs> is that the GoPro? Yeah, it is. Whoa. Do you want to use it later? Full body. <laughs> Yours? Hmm? Yours? I don't know, I'm just getting them fighting. <laughs> yeah, this, is this is yours, right? Yeah. yeah, yeah. You have finished this for me? You don't want it? Okay, it's burning. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Push yourself. You wanna go? You wanna go first? <laughs> How'd that feel? Oh, it was great. Nice. It was great? It was great. Nice. Oh, s***. Icy as f***. I'm gonna get that. Cheers, lads. Most disgusting. <laughs> Dude, it's so gross. My bad, Sarah. <laughs> Fuck.
<laughs> oh, it's all video. Yeah. <laughs>